Thanks for being with us. Witnesses coming forward tonight in the case against a community liaison officer at a Hamtramck High School. It's a story we first brought you last night. Ibrahim al Jahim charged with forcing a student with special needs to perform a sex act just outside school. Sean Lay live in Hamtramck. Uh, Sean, the case could be growing? could be expanding. That's what we're learning tonight from our sources, Devin and Kimberly. Good evening. Sources confirming there may be more victims connected to Ibrahim Al-Jahim. We know police here in Hamtramck are dealing with security camera video of Al-Jahim and his accuser leaving school the day these allegations came down and then returning to school 20 minutes later. Now listen closely tonight. We're hearing from students who saw that happen. Well, there's cameras in the classroom and also the bathroom. So they should see when they when Mr. Ibrahim took him out to school. This student at Hamtramck's Oakland International Academy says he watched school employee and activist Ibrahim Al Jahim remove an 18 year old student with special needs from class last Thursday. The teen returned and was clearly in distress, telling three classmates that Al Jahim allegedly sexually assaulted him in a car right outside of the school. Hamtramck police were called. Police sources confirm Al Jahim left the scene. The students say they watched him leave. Once the police arrived, they, he stayed in there for like maybe a minute or two, and then he just he saw, like, checked out and left the school. Three students tried to help the victim, and they say they are the ones who immediately came under suspicion from the school for the incident instead of Al Jahim. By dismissal time, Al Jahim returned to the school. One parent says he tried to place blame on their child for the awful attack. He told my husband that my son was in big trouble, that um, is something about a sexual misconduct again, you know, in, in the school, and that the police were there and they were questioning him. I was actually surprised, and I don't think that, you know, they should have even had him in the school, period. Now, a short time later, Hamtramck police caught up with Ibrahim Al-Jahim and did arrest him. Prosecutors have charged him with two counts of criminal sexual conduct in the first degree. He's out on bond right now. Did speak to the principal of that school, Devin and Kimberly. He says that he's been placed on permanent leave from that school. Back to you. Well, Sean, the school sent home a letter to parents a full week after these allegations were made. A full week. Why, why the delay? Parents we're speaking to tonight absolutely outraged by that talk to the principal talk to school officials tonight they're citing what they're calling student privacy the reason why they didn't say anything until mm. today and they also wanted to protect their employees due process so that letter did come out today a full week after the allegations came down yeah. all right sean